A few years ago, Patrick and his buddy Eric were two 20-year-olds with an idea. What if they could create a business recycling electronic waste? Electronic waste is a fascinating puzzle because it contains extremely valuable metals such as gold and copper, but at the same time it contains other metals such as lead, mercury, and cadmium that are extremely dangerous. The key is to separate the valuable trash from the toxic trash. The result can be a business that makes money and protects the planet at the same time. My name is Patrick Wilkinson and I'm in a very green business. I recycle electronics and I really enjoy what I do. We're a state certified uh, collector of electronics and the state reimburses us for providing a free service to the public. The way we make money is on a per poundage basis of all sorts of electronics, monitors, CPUs. We do a lot of breakdown with certain motherboards, hard drives, and that sort of thing. Because landfills do no longer accept electronics, we're paid by the government to provide a free service. I'm only 25 years old. I actually just turned 25 and I started business, doing business at age 20. And my business partner and I, we have been friends for many years and at a young age, we knew we wanted to get into business with one another. We're both very into the environment. Both of us are big backpackers, hikers, fishermen. And we wanted to make a change, a positive change in this area so that we could see the electronic waste that we're recycling has an impact on Earth. Basically, you, what you need to do is know how to separate everything into certain areas because certain machinery is recycled in different ways. The portion that's worth money and the portion that is taken out mostly is these circuit boards. Now in these circuit boards you have certain types of metals including silver, gold, lead, and platinum. And so these boards are taken apart and all the metal pieces and plastic pieces are melted and the, the plastic is broken down and reused as well. 